Hello, everyone. It's that time of year again. It's Medical Laboratory Professionals Week from April 24th through April 30th. The Medical Lab Lady Gill community is going to be doing some fun and engaging activities. Number one, the first thing that we're going to do is a Twitter takeover. So please join us and medical laboratory students from around the world to take over Twitter with medical laboratory education. Also, we have the Lab Week Lotto back this year, but with some different ways of going about submitting your lotto ticket. And then the last thing that we're going to talk about is that I have recorded a wonderful game show with your favorite microbiologist, and it's called Pictionary Micro Edition. We have so much fun, and we're looking forward to sharing it with you during Lab Week. So what should you be doing? Well, make sure you stay connected with us throughout this whole entire time. We have the social media accounts over here for Medical Lab Lady Gill. We have the YouTube channel, the store, and um, the Twitter account. And so please make sure to tag Medical Lab Lady G on Twitter and use the hashtag Lab Week 2022 and all of your posts to share in the fun and all your winnings that are happening throughout the week. So let's talk a little bit about the Twitter takeover. So participants are expected to uh, decide what type of topic they're going to cover, but it has to be medical laboratory oriented. So that includes all of these different parts of the lab that I have listed here. And uh, you can ask your professor for extra credit for this activity because it is about you engaging and teaching perspective uh, medical laboratory enthusiasts or students, but it's also going to help you to engage with the current professionals out there and hopefully expand your network of uh, mentors and uh, people that can help assist you in getting and achieve or getting to the places that you want to be and achieving the professional goals that you would like to do. So here are the requirements for the tweet. Um, you need to make sure that the original tweet of the tutorial is including myself, but also you're tagging uh, using hashtag MedLabChat and hashtag LabWeek2022. And that way uh, we can always share it and spread it to lab leaders across the world and help you to engage with these hopefully mentors uh, so that you can start to be recognized for your efforts and your knowledge and your professionalism. So the tweet should include uh, responses and comments for the rest of the tutorial. So the three polling questions that I ask that you include, they will be in tweets that are responses to this original tweet of the tutorial. Don't forget that because if you do it in separate uh, Twitter tweets, it's going to be really crazy and nobody's going to be able to follow you. All right. So make sure it's just one original tweet with several uh, comments afterwards. So please add three polling questions that last for three days and uh, include two or more answer options. The idea here is that we want to solve a problem or uh, share something that you find really, really exciting about whatever topic that you've chosen. And in that topic, you you could make polling questions that includes information on stuff that you find that you and your classmates are usually struggling with or that gets confusing and you'd like to clarify. This is your time to teach others in a fun and engaging way. So whenever you have these questions, we ask that you have two or more options for the uh, participants to engage with. And what you're going to notice is that all of the responses, the answers are going to be 
anonymous. So whoever is engaging with your polling question, you're not going to know who they are. You're just going to know how many people engaged and how many um, percentage of that those amount of people chose certain uh, answer choices. Okay, and so the blue highlighted version is just going to be the most popular answer, and it may not be the correct one. So if that's the case, you can review this polling question and decide, hey, maybe I need to add another commented tweet to make sure that everyone is getting the correct and appropriate information. So in that case, you want to make sure to include any YouTube videos or links to other informational sites that can provide information to help your uh, users and viewers uh, gain that information and do better if they happen to get it wrong. In this whole process, we just ask that you remain very professional and use only HIPAA compliant information and pictures. The goal is to spread your network, but if you choose to use a Twitter account that has any vulgar, demeaning, hateful, or unprofessional language or Twitter name, so the Twitter handle, I personally will not share those tweets. This is expected to be an educational information type of activity. And I am not going to um, promote any foul play or hateful actions. So please make sure that when you choose your Twitter handle, that it is something that's professional and appropriate. If you have one that you're using that isn't professional and appropriate, you can absolutely still um, engage with this activity, but I will not be sharing those tweets, okay? Um, so here we have two more, actually three more of our lab swag that's offered for the Lab Week Lotto. Uh, we have the graduating class of 2022 for both MLT and MLS hoodies here. And then uh, the last option is the there's a culture for that line. So this is our microbiology line. All right. So the lab week lotto is the same kind of thing that we did last year when we first opened up the store. And what, um, what it is, is a lottery. So that means there is a purchase. OK, if you don't want to participate in this, you don't have to. But the idea is that you purchase a uh, piece of Medical Lab Lady Gill swag and then you take a screenshot of that confirmation email that you get from Spring. That's the company that the store is through. And so you'll get an email that will have your confirmation number and the items that or item that you purchased in there. So I'm just asking that you take a screenshot of that information and submit it to this Google form. So this Google form is going to be the way that you can participate within the Lab Week lot of Lotto. If you participate by purchasing, but you don't fill out the form or you don't fill out the form entirely, then you cannot participate and you're, um, you won't end up winning anything from the lottery. How do you know if you won? Well, uh, winners will be announced on the YouTube channel community link, but will also be on the Twitter account feed. You need to make sure to submit your tickets between April 1st and the 29th, and the last day of announcements will be April 30th. So that's the very last uh, day of uh, Medical Laboratory Professionals Week. Okay, so I will show you what that uh what that uh, form looks like in a minute, just make sure that you're using a Google account. If you don't have a Google account, you can't fill out the Google form. You must use that account. All right, and so the last and very exciting 
part of our lab week celebration is the Pictionary micro edition episode. This is the first game show uh, that will be where you see the participation of the game while you're watching the episode. So come join our world-renowned microbiologists in a really zany and fun competition of wits and drawing skills. That's what they've been practicing. They're practicing their um, Zoom whiteboard drawing skills because that's really what they're going to need. It is very hard uh, to draw using Zoom. And I'm sure that you've laughed at your professors throughout this whole time of COVID <laughs> where they're trying to use the whiteboard and show you things. It's very hard to do. So come enjoy uh, laughing and joking around with these amazing individuals who have contributed so much to the field. Uh, the release date of this episode is going to be the beginning of lab week. So you can watch it all week long and have a really good time. Each of our participants within this episode have extensive knowledge of current trends, topics, and techniques in medical microbiology, and their contributions have been from decades worth of work. So uh, their contributions include blogs, tutorials that you're just like the ones you're going to be doing uh, during this whole week. Uh, they several of them contribute to ASM through articles in the journal. Um, there have been TED Talks, CDC research, you know, the Centers for Disease Control, and uh, you know, a lot of the treatments and identification of common pathogens now, like viruses and parasites we take for granted, but you're looking at some of the individuals that had the research and the development of these diagnostic tests and treatments for these, uh, these types of conditions. So this is incredible to have all of these people um, on the show. So I'm so excited. And we also recognize, of course, Mr. Aaron Odegaard over here, who is a specialist in microbiology. He was our um, co-host throughout the Cell Bowl, and will continue to be, by the way, when we continue on in uh, season two this year. <laughs> so please come and join uh, myself and all of these amazing microbiologists uh, to really, really celebrate the medical laboratory profession. And in this way, we're going to be talking about microbiology. All right, so we're going to take a second and look at the uh, form, the lotto form that you need to submit. Okay, so here is the form. Once you go into the link, you'll see this. And uh, I ask that you fill out your email, first and last name. And your email, by the way, is only going to be used in order to contact you to make sure that the information provided um, is all that is necessary, necessary to get you the item you chose, okay, for the Lab Week Lotto. I need you to submit your lotto ticket right here. So you're going to add a, a picture file, okay? And it's just it just needs to have the confirmation number and picture of at least one item of lab swag that you ordered just to show that it truly was, um, you know, part of something from the store. And then what we're going to do is also uh, have you select what it is that you want uh, to have as your winning. So uh, your winning material, sorry. So here we have um, the shirts and the hoodies that I just showed you in the uh, beginning of this video. And it's asking you to select a size. I want to caution you that when you select the item and you select the color, which is down here, there's these different colors. When you do that, not all the colors have the available sizes here. 
All right, so you can go on to the website and make sure um, the store website is uh, was shown to you earlier in the video. You can also Google Medical Lab Lady Gill store and um, search whatever item it was that you were looking at. And uh, all these colors may not necessarily be part of that too. They mainly are, but uh, it might not be offered in all of the same colors. So please just make sure that you double check um, when you figure out which one you want that it's offered in the size you want and also the color that you want. Now, you may um, have the color and the size um, be an option, but it might not be compatible with each other. So Spring is a store that orders a certain amount of different items. So I have no control over how much of a 5XL uh, shirt they have in um, whatever whatever color you decided you wanted, okay? So sometimes they really run out of colors quickly because uh, they're a very popular color or they just didn't happen to get that much of an order in for that. And it might be that we have to wait a little bit for that, okay? So that is an instance where I may be emailing you and asking, do you wanna try a different color or, um, do you want to try a different item with that color just to make sure that you get what you want? Again, I have no control over the amount of stock of the spring store, okay? Uh, so really, that's it. I hope to um, engage with you all throughout social media and make sure that you have a great time. Again, don't forget to submit your Lab Week Lotto ticket and to use uh, hashtags and appropriate um, handles on social media in order to make sure that we are sharing your engaging uh, tutorials and all the fun that you're posting. All right. Um, I hope to see a lot of you participate and that we have a lot of fun and let me know how you like it. Uh, make sure you comment and share. Have a great one. I'll catch you next time. Bye.